Drivers have the ability to add, edit, and delete duty status changes from their mobile device. Please note, you cannot delete or edit an ELD recorded driving event or the on-duty event immediately following it. In this video, we will review how to make an edit to an existing status event from your mobile device. Let's begin. Tap the Logs button on the Driver Overview screen. Your log grid opens. Tap Events. Use the navigation arrows in the upper left-hand corner to find the event date that you want to edit. You may need to scroll to locate the event. Tap on the event to highlight. New options to edit, annotate, and delete a log event appear. Tap Edit. The Edit Log Event screen loads. Select the event information you want to edit. To edit the duty status of the event, tap Status. The Edit Status window opens. Tap the desired duty status. To edit the start time of the event, tap Start Time. The Set Start Time window opens. Slide the hour, minute, second, and AM PM columns up or down to adjust the time of the event. Tap OK. To edit the location information of the event, tap Location. The Enter the Location window and Virtual Keyboard opens. Long press the Delete button on the Virtual Keyboard to remove the old city information. Enter the new city information. Tap the State Province drop-down arrow to select the correct option. Tap OK. To edit the CMV power unit of the event, tap CMV power unit. The Select CMV power unit window opens. Tap the CMV power unit drop-down arrow for a list of available vehicles. Select the CMV power unit or not applicable if the edit did not occur in any of the available vehicles. Select Add CMV to manually enter the vehicle number. Tap OK. Tap Reason for Change. The Reason for Change window opens. Tap the Enter Annotation text field to open the virtual keyboard. Type the reason for the log edit, then tap Submit. Review the information to ensure it is correct. Tap Save to add the event to your logs. The Certification Agreement window appears. When you edit a log event from a previously certified log date, the system requires you to recertify for that date. To continue without recertifying, tap Not Ready. To recertify your logs, tap Enter Password. The virtual keyboard opens. Enter your password, then tap Agree. If you operate in Canada and the ELD has lost connection to the vehicle, the change to driver's log confirmation window opens. This informs you that required data elements were omitted from the certification event. Refer to your carrier for assistance. Tap Confirm to close the window. The corrected event now appears with an active status in your log events. The former event status now reads inactive changed. Your available drive time may be recalculated to reflect the change. Tap Home to return to the Driver Overview screen. You have completed the editing and existing duty status training video. To learn more about this product, visit our Learning Center to access on-demand training and online help.